There's a nice block by Duquesne. Maddie Basilak, Abby Trezak, and Danny Swain. That serve handled by Vasera. Now Basilak swinging hard, and Okoro can't absorb enough of the power from Basilak. So Duquesne scores again. They lead 20 to 18 with their best server at the service line. Long serves, Levers again. This time she handles it well, gets it up to Suter. To have it down the line, nobody can get there for St. Louis. And there was a nice in-system play by Duquesne. Yeah, David again, clutch player. Little run there by St. Louis, Duquesne. Uh, David gets it up to Suter. Here's Trezak. And Trezak powers it home. Rogelski wasn't able to get it back over the net there. Klein will take that one. Suter sets across to Davitt. Davitt with authority. And the kill for Molly Davitt and the Dukes. They lead 19-15. And a service ace ends the third set. Sammy Klein finishes it off. And the Dukes take it 25-21. And they now lead 2-1 in sets over the St. Louis team. So after three, Duquesne. The set by Suter. Basilak blocks. Suter again over to Basilak. Basilak down the middle. And a critical side out for the Dukes there. They get the point. They now trail 9 to 6. St. Louis is a good team. And when you give them opportunities to, to play balls up and don't terminate or swing aggressively, I think that you know, puts you in a bad spot. What will you have your team working on before the last regular season game against LaSalle? Just like I said, being aggressive. You know, I think we made too many errors on our side of the court. Um, against St. Louis, they, they played well and they beat us. But if we cut down our errors and our silly, silly mistakes of letting balls drop on the floor without people going after it, I think good things will happen. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks. Thanks.